Welcome. My name is Julie Muse, and I am excited and honored to share just a little snippet into my journey with you. Um, just a little bit of background. I am a wife and a mom, as you can see here. I live in the St. Louis, Missouri area. I have a four and two year old uh, as of 2018, a little boy and a little girl. And I have a background in corporate America in sales. And I had a wonderful career in sales for about nine years uh, before I had my firstborn. And at about the same time, I found a product. And the product instantly made sense to me, um, but the business behind the product did not. And that's really what this short little call is going to be about. I would like to introduce you to my story and my journey um, from being a complete skeptic of network marketing and moving it over to being an entrepreneur. Um, and I'm really proud of this business now in this industry. And I did not start out that way. And so I just want to share with you what I've learned along the way in hopes that it can help you with your journey. So here starts the story. Uh, this was where I was about four and a half years ago when I learned about an amazing product called Juice Plus. I knew um, I had spent about two years prior really looking into the connection between nutrition and disease. And my health journey and my journey into wellness really started um, about six years ago when my mom was diagnosed with an autoimmune disease called rheumatoid arthritis. And it caused me to really look into this connection between nutrition and disease. So I had spent two years um, really learning, learning up, watching documentaries, researching, um, studying people with a more holistic approach. Um, and I had just really spent two years learning that the answer really can be in our food and that not only are fruits and vegetables powerful, but they're so powerful for us, they could actually save our lives. So when my sister dragged me to this event four and a half years ago to learn about this product called Juice Plus, and that's me and my sister about four years ago, um, to be honest, I was really annoyed because at the time, everything that I knew about that was sold in this fashion um, had a big warning label on it that it was, you know, it was great for you as long as you weren't pregnant, nursing, or under the age of 12. Or it had really questionable ingredients. And because I had spent two years, um, you know, learning about how powerful what we put in our body is, I was very skeptic um, of really the supplement industry and the vitamin industry for sure. And I kind of had my guard up about going to this event to learn more about Juice Plus. But I remembered that my uncle, who had been fighting melanoma about 17 years prior, was taking Ju Juice Plus. And that was unique to me. So I decided that I was curious enough to learn a little bit more. Um, and that evening, what I learned totally made sense. And I'm not going to go super far into um, information about the Juice Plus product today. Um, but I felt like somebody hit the easy button on juicing and I was so excited. And what really made it stand out to me was when I learned that when my son was six months old, I could take that capsule, open it up and put it in his food because it was just food. And that spoke to me. And so the product made instant sense. Um, and because my sister, you know, dragged me to this event and it was her first time to learn about Juice Plus as well, you know, they told her, they said, well, you should totally be a rep with the Juice Plus company. You're going to order all this product. So is your sister. It's going to make financial sense. You should, you should be a rep. And my sister looked at me and she said, Julie, I'm going to be a rep with Juice Plus. You should totally be a rep with me. And I looked at her and I said, I will never, ever do one of those things. And still to this day, I'm not exactly sure where that stigma came from, but I'm glad I had it because it caused me to look really, really deep into a lot of things, which you'll continue to learn about. But I was like, absolutely not to that business. Um, but this was what spoke to me, you know, concentrated whole food based nutrition in a capsule, broccoli and kale in a capsule that spoke to me. Um, so I decided I was going to get started on the product and I had zero expectations. Um, and, you know, I really believe with Juice Plus, you should have zero expectations. You know, I wanted to get on it because it made sense. And I wanted to get on it to prevent disease. I did not want to have to deal with what my mom was dealing with in her early 50s. Um, and so what happened was about two months in, I actually had an experience. I found that I had more energy. You know, and here I was a full-time working mom, you know, nursing and pumping and I should have been more tired than I'd ever been in my life. Um, and I had more energy than I had had in years. I found that I was happier, which I later learned is because over 80% of our serotonin is made in our gut. Um, and I was finally just feeding my gut well and giving it what it needed. And my body knew what to do with that. 
uh, you know, I also embraced more lifestyle changes that are associated with our company. And I ended up having a weight loss experience, which Juice Plus is not a weight loss product, but it was a catalyst for change for both my sister and I. Um, and I also, you know, I used to be sick all the time. This is my sister and I just, just a couple months later. And I was that person that, you know, had terrible allergies that would end up turning into a sinus infection. I was on antibiotic about every other month. And here I was two months in, and I hadn't had my antibiotic yet. And now here I am over four and a half years later, and I have not been on an antibiotic in four and a half years, which was not my life prior to Juice Plus. And I can look back now and see that I really was on, um, I really was having issues with my immune system for sure. That thankfully Juice Plus has been part of, uh, part of helping, which has been a huge blessing to me. So here I was, you know, two months later, having this experience that I did not expect at all, and I wanted to know why. And so I decided that I was going to look into the research behind Juice Plus, and I was going to figure out why it was so powerful in my body. And the more I learned about the research and the why behind the product, the more that I believed that everyone deserved to know that this product was out there. And still to this day, my mission is not that I make sure people take Juice Plus, but my mission is that I believe that everyone, and specifically every mom, deserves to know that they put kale and broccoli into a capsule. I think that that should be baseline for any, for any mom and really anyone in the world, because we all can benefit from simple nutrition. We all need more of it. Um, and so it was at that point, about two months in, that I decided to align with the company and partner with the Juice Plus company, kind of begrudgingly, but really just because I believed that people deserve to know. Um, and because I partnered with this company, um, I decided to plug in. So I did something really important in the beginning, and I went to two business events, two events about you know, our mission and our company. And it wasn't going to these events that my eyes were really opened. And I realized that I have something, I had something that I have now dubbed as the golden handcuffs. So I had spent eight years in um, a sales career and I did well. Um, you know, I was the breadwinner for our family. I had a lucrative paycheck. Um, my, you know, when I had my son, I left my six figure job for one slightly below it because I needed more work life balance. I could see at that point already that it was not going to be sustainable with the family. Um, but still, you know, I had built something that I loved. I loved that I earned this paycheck and I loved what I did up until I had my son. And I was dropping him off, you know, every morning at 6 a.m. and picking him up at 5.30 in the evening and realizing I was totally handcuffed. And yeah, my handcuffs were gold. Yes, I had a great paycheck, but I was stuck. You know, I was handcuffed to a boss. I was handcuffed to a commute. I was handcuffed to a vacation schedule. I was handcuffed to eight to 10 hours a day of just giving away my time and trading that for that gold, right? Um, and it was kind of through this community and, and, and just learning more about another way that I realized that I was stuck. Um, and I heard this, you know, early on, or, or actually I think I heard something similar to this and kind of put it into a quote. Um, Never settle for a situation where someone else tells you your next goal. And I kind of could look back in my life and realize that was exactly what I had done all along. And you should, right, when you're young. I mean, you should follow the advice of others. But, you know, the goal was go to college and get a degree. And so I did that. And then the goal was get a job in sales. And so I did that. And then the goal was hit this quota number. And so I did that and get this promotion. And so I did that. And I really could look back and see, oh, my gosh, like I would go into my boss's office every month and be like, okay, what do you need me to do next? I mean, never was there this autonomy of like what I wanted to do or where did I want this to be in five years or how did I want this to fit more into my life? It was always doing this for someone else, someone else and, you know, projecting their goal on me. And I did it, but I didn't really like where it was leading me. And then somebody asked me this question and it really was the game changer for me. She said, um, I want you to consider, you know, in your job right now, uh, best case scenario. You know, if, if you worked your tail off, where could you be, you know, in five or 10 years, best case scenario. And I thought about it and I thought about, um, you know, okay, my boss is boss. If I really worked hard, you know, I could probably have his job in about five or 10 years. And she said, now I want you to consider that person and their lifestyle. And is that what you want? And, you know, this person specifically, you know, he worked in the city that I lived in a lot, but he lived somewhere else and he had 
three beautiful children at home, but he was spending much time in, you know, a lot of his time in another city. Um, he was that person that when he entered the room, you could feel the stressful energy because we had a very stressful job and he was carrying a lot of it. So, you know, I know now how terrible stress is for her, for our health. So not only could you feel that stressful energy off of him, but you could see very much physically that he was unhealthy. Of course, he was on the road traveling like crazy. And then I thought, um, you know, if I thought I had golden handcuffs, his handcuffs were much more gold than mine and much tighter. You know, I had a job in sales. And so when you have a job where you're earning commission, if you ever want to leave that company, you're going to take a hit. And so we were very much stuck um, in a way, even more maybe than your, your typical person with our role. And so he was incredibly stuck because yes, he had a lucrative paycheck, but he didn't have a lot of options. And it was at that point that I thought, oh my gosh, I spend 50 to 60 hours a week walking on this path that I don't even like where it's going to land me in five to 10 years. And I hadn't even thought about it until that time. And that's crazy. And in the meantime, I was plugging into my Juice Plus business. I was working it on nights and weekends. It was very much a plan B, very much less than part-time. And through the community, I was seeing people that had decided to plug into this opportunity, you know, over the past 20 years. And they were enjoying health. They were enjoying vibrancy. They were enjoying time freedom and they were enjoying financial freedom. And I thought, that is a better investment of my time where that could lend me land me in five to 10 years is a better investment of my time. But I had this hiccup, right? Like I really didn't want to be different. I really didn't want to do network marketing. I didn't want to have to be one of those people. Right. Um, so I decided I needed to figure out why, you know, why was this not a good investment of my time? And I decided to look into network marketing and where you may not agree with everybody on this list, you likely would maybe want to trade pocketbooks um, with them. But I looked in and saw, oh my gosh, you know, network marketing is recommended by Les Brown, Warren Buffett. I believe he just bought a network marketing company, Robert Kiyosaki and Richard Branson. What really spoke to me is that Chuck Norris recommends Choose Plus. I'm being facetious there. I think it's funny that he's on this list, but some people with some really wonderful financial sense see massive value in network marketing. And that spoke to me. And then, you know, Dave Ramsey is, is a brilliant financial advisor and he's someone that we, you know, we follow a lot of his protocol for, for our family personally and the way we spend our money. And I saw that he was saying, the worst thing that you could do is get a second job. The best thing you could do is start a home-based business. And back then I really didn't realize, you know, the um, positive impacts that having a home-based business can have. Um, just in, in, in the fact that you're an entrepreneur, right? And you can, there are things, there are some tax incentives there. Um, and so I saw that he was encouraging a home-based business and I thought that that was interesting. Um, and then I, you know, I, I really started to realize how vast this industry was, right? So this was 2013 global sales and the NFL in the 2013 was nine and a half billion music, 15 billion video gaming, 76 billion natural foods, which really my industry could kind of fall into 90 billion network marketing was a $178 billion industry in 2013. I know it's much bigger now. Um, and I thought, oh my gosh. And even, you know, when I was preparing this presentation, I was Googling something about network marketing and I saw all these articles. Is it a scam? Can you really make money? All this stuff about network marketing. And the truth is, I'm here to tell you, it's a $178 billion plus billion dollar industry. It is not a scam. It is not going anywhere. And yes, you can make money. Um, but I thought, you know, there's this picture of a slice of pie. And I thought, if somebody came up to me and they said, do you want a slice, just a tiny slice of the NFL? I would jump all over that. I would be there in a second. But here I am now, and I've woken up to this opportunity now for over four and a half years. I wake up every morning to an opportunity of my little slice of a much bigger pie in network marketing. Um, and it's a very, that was kind of when I realized this is a very real opportunity. You know, but what about the people, right? Because you hear these lies that, oh, you had to get in, in the beginning in order to make money and all this stuff. Well, what network marketing does is they know that word of mouth is the strongest form of advertising. 
And many companies spend about 30 to 40 percent on advertising. So network marketing companies just take the money that they would spend on advertising and instead they pay it to the person who has already shared via word of mouth and um, and successfully successfully shared a product with someone and they pay them in the form of commissions. So network marketing companies pay about 40% in commissions to distributors from that $178 billion, which adds up to $71 billion a year, $6 billion a month, and $200 million a day that is being paid to real people. And that was eye-opening to me because I was already plugged in enough to this community to see there were lots of people, lots of different people. It was not all the same kind of personality, different ages, different races, um, coming from different places, speaking different languages, earning, these were real people earning very real money, actually earning very substantial incomes with this opportunity. I'd already seen that by plugging into the community. And here I was seeing it, you know, just, just the actual numbers that this is, this is paid to real people and this is real money that they're earning. It's a real business. That's what I was realizing. So <laughs> with an opportunity like network marketing, you have the ability to earn residual income. Well, what is residual income? Residual income is money earned past the point of sale. Some people call it mailbox money. That's why there's a mailbox on here. Um, you know, you have residual bills, right? You have the water bill. It's going to come every single month. Um, when I started my business four and a half years ago, I had conversations with people and I shared the product with people and they signed up and I still, they're still my customer and I still earn money, you know, on that conversation every month. Many of them had a great, in, a great experience and it ended up joining my team and then they shared with more people. And so that income has even grown that I'm earning off of them. It's something that grows. It, it, it compounds on itself. Um, you know, there's a famous quote out there that if people understood the power of residual income, they would run through a brick wall to get it. And many of us and standard Americans are working on the regular income model. It grows linear. We are trading our time for dollars. You know, I give you eight hours a day, you give me this amount of money. It's this even trade, sometimes not so even. Um, and usually then we are financially dependent on our job. I know I, I for sure was then. Um, we don't have enough time always then to enjoy our income. And that's where I was, right? I had this lucrative paycheck, but I was trading most of my waking hours in order to earn that. And then if my work stopped, my income stopped. That's why I felt so handcuffed, right? I had to be there. I was, I was stuck. But residual income has the opportunity to grow exponentially. It has the opportunity to compound upon itself where you could then gain true financial independence because this income is coming in every single month and you can have time freedom. It's not tied to you showing up and sitting at a desk every single, you know, for a certain amount of hours every single day. And that income can continue to be created. And that's what really spoke to me. So if network marketing was starting to make more sense, and I already knew I loved this amazing product, which was literally a farmer's market or a salad bar in a capsule, what about this company? Well, I'm just going to give you real quick, I'm going to run down what is the Juice Plus company. Well, we are mission driven. Um, our mission is to inspire healthy living around the world. And we offer a virtual franchise. So we really don't consider ourselves solely direct sales. We are a blend of some of multiple models. Um, but you really have an opportunity to start a franchise of your own virtually without any brick or mortar. And it's only $50 a year to start with, or it is $50 a year to partner with the Juice Plus company. We have no inventory, no territory, no quotas. Um, I believe we're a $14 billion company. We've been around for 49 years, very unique in this space. Um, one of the longest, you know, companies in this space. We have the opportunity to earn residual income with exponential growth and time freedom. This is really important. At the top level of our company, which there are many people at this level, um, you have the opportunity to earn a corporate benefits package for your family. Um, one that rivals many corporate America uh, corporate benefit packages and is better than many corporate benefits packages. This is not, you know, just a crummy insurance opportunity. Um, it's a it's a great one. Um, I had a hard time arguing with that, right? I was trying to figure out why I shouldn't invest my time, why I wasn't going to do network marketing, but a benefits package. This is what allows people to go full time with our opportunity. Um, this is what allows, you know, people in, that are in retirement to be covered. I mean, it, that brings freedom. A benefits package 
can bring freedom. So in terms of our product, we are the most researched, largest selling um, product with a, you know, a nutraceutical with a food label. We have the highest level of certification in NSF. We offer free juice plus to children, which makes it affordable for families. It's media driven, which I'll talk about in a second. Doctor recommended a part of the booming wellness industry. It's global. We're in over 26 countries. Um, we are product driven and we are consumable. And I want to hit on consumable. So when my son was six months old, I opened up the Juice Plus capsules, put it in his mouth. My grandma is 86. She takes Juice Plus every day. She has been for, you know, for over 15 years. They don't know how she's still kicking and she drinks uh, Papa Baca every day and smokes a pack of cigarettes and they really can't understand it. But she is, I know why. Um, so here they are, right? Six months old, 86 years old. From womb to tomb, it doesn't matter if you're healthy, unhealthy, if you're fit, if you're not, if you're, what color your skin is, fruits and vegetables are needed by everyone every single day. And our product, Juice Plus, is needed. You take it every single day. At the bottom of a bottle, you need more. That is a brilliant way, thing for you to invest your time into financially for what that could build you. Not only do people need this, but they need it every single day and they'll always need more. Oh, it's amazing. So then I heard this because I believed that you had, so then I, I had that thought, right? Of you have to get in the beginning, right? Everyone says, you'll, you'll see it with network marketing companies. Oh, they're new. This is, you need to jump in now, right? Because it's only the people at the top that are going to earn money, right? Um, and so I want you to think about this. This is called the S curve. It's, it's a life cycle in business. Um, you know, consider a cell phone, right? So at, at some point, you know, you knew there was that one in 100 person who had a cell phone. They were big, they were bulky, they weren't easy to use, they were expensive. Um, but then in this infancy time period for the cell phone, <clears throat> they came up with, you know, a way to make them easier to use, a way to make them more affordable. Um, and then very quickly, within a matter of just a couple of years, it went from one in a hundred people had a cell phone, nine in 10 people had a cell phone and it was standard, right? Same thing happened with the car when they came up with financing the assembly line. Well, I learned that Juice Plus, Juice Plus is in 2% of homes and my jaw almost fell to the floor because a lot of people want to say, you got to get in in the beginning if you want to make some headway. And that is simply not true. It's actually easier now than it has ever been to do this business. And it's growing faster now than it has ever been. There are people joining this business, earning incomes that others took 10 years to create and they're earning it in a year or two. It's, it's, it's remarkable. So what has been happening over the past 25 years? Juice Plus, the product has been on the market for 25 years. We've been in this infancy time period and what has been going on? Well, I will tell you, Three things, three amazing things have been happening while we've been in infancy. Number one, we decided to conduct research, which has made us the most researched whole food product in the world, far and away above anything else. Nothing even comes close and really will come close. It's, it's hard. You, you couldn't catch up with this body of research. It's so vast, expansive, and, and well done. Um, so we decided to prove that this product works on human beings with blood drawn. It's not only based on stories. It's real. That's been happening. At the same time, we are getting sicker and sicker and sicker. We are realizing that Western medicine is symptom management, so it is not addressing the root cause. And then finally, the third thing that's been happening, that media-driven piece. It is coming out. We are learning that food really is medicine. We are learning the link between nutrition and disease. People are starting to want to invest in prevention and wellness instead of treat sickness with symptom management. It's coming out in food documentaries. It's on the news. It's well, the well, wellness is booming and it's only going to continue to boom and grow because everybody wants vibrancy. Everybody wants wellness. And here we are in 2% of homes. So this expansion period, because I do believe Juice Plus is going to be on every countertop. It is already doctor recommended. I believe it will only become more recommended by doctors, uh, but you don't have to be a doctor to recommend it. It's fruits and vegetables. It just makes sense. So this expansion period is happening. This is an amazing train to be jumping onto because we're in 2% of homes and we are going to be in 90 plus percent of homes. This product makes sense to everyone. Everyone needs it. And so when I saw that opportunity for growth and when I saw that this is easier, it's easier than ever, than ever before 
to share this product. I don't even have to explain to people anymore why fruits and vegetables are good for them. They get that now. 25 years ago, they were still making a case for that. It's an amazing spot to be. So that I started to think, what if? And I will tell you there are power, there's power in those two words. Think about your life. Think, what if? You know, for me, it was, what if I could work from anywhere? What if I didn't sit in the car commuting 30 minutes every morning, every, every evening, time I could be with my children or with someone I, you know, I cared to spend time with? What if I woke up to passion? What if I was excited about what I did? You know, in my, in my full-time job, I, uh, I used to help staff IT people for large telecom companies. And I remember sitting across the desk from somebody and he was talking to me about his IT needs for their big network upgrade. And all of a sudden it dawned on me as he was speaking, I don't care at all about this company's network upgrade at all. Like I'm not passionate about it. And then I looked at him and I thought, he doesn't either, but he doesn't even know it because he's worked for this company for 30 years and he's been paid probably 80 grand now to care about their network upgrade. But does he really care? Is there really passion behind his company's network upgrade? But my friend whose son had asthma and was given four prescription medications who's no longer taking those, that I can get passionate about. But the network upgrade just wasn't, wasn't, wasn't doing it for me. So what if I earned an income by doing well for others? You know, what if I was really paid because I was helping people get healthier? And what if there was no cap? There was unlimited income potential. What if there was income in retirement? You know, we, we store and we store and we save and we save. Many people, you know, are retiring and then losing their lives now. You know, the um, life expectancy is, is de decreased, which is very scary. That's a whole other conversation. So what if you actually had $500 a month, $1,000 a month, $5,000 a month, $10,000 a month coming in when you're 65, when you're 70, when you're 75, when you're 45? What if you had a corporate benefits package for you and your spouse and your children that was not tied to you sitting at a desk all day? And then for me, my big dream is what if I could bring my husband home early? You know, what if that family unit became the family unit? So a year into plugging into my Juice Plus business, I stepped away from my, um, my corporate America job, not because the Juice Plus paycheck had replaced my, my corporate America paycheck yet. Um, in fact, this is not a get rich quick. It, people do earn, um, very, can earn, earn very substantial income very quickly if you'd like. Um, however, this is a get rich slowly, if that's what you'd like. Um, but I realized that this opportunity was a better investment of my time for our family financially long-term. And I was shocked when I realized that because I did not believe this was real, right? So this is me with my daughter working. She's probably like two months old at the time I'm at a training. Um, and that's what I did. It was different. It's a different way, but I decided it was a better investment and it is a good investment no matter how you do it. I'd already spent a year working full time, just working this business for 20 to 30 minutes in the evening. It's brilliant. And it had paid for a mortgage in six months. That's substantial income for a family that can make a big difference. So this is just me with some people that had, that had come alongside, you know, um, there's my friend who was struggling with weak spells and, and couldn't go out of the house with her, with her kids um, because she, she didn't always have strength and nutrition helped her with that. This was my, you know, the beautiful blonde friend on the top left, you know, her daughter was struggling with asthma and she was so frustrated with giving her, you know, these, these drugs all the time. And she wanted to find a better way. And my friend with the curly hair, she had no idea that people could earn income working from home. Um, my friend with the glasses, oh my gosh, they're all so beautiful. She has cystic fibrosis and she learned, she's in her 40s, she has an amazing story. She started to learn this information about nutrition and disease and she thought, I've lived with a chronic disease my whole life. I deserve to know that information. And she's making sure other people that live with a chronic disease know that. And then my friend here on the very far right, her nurse friend, the blonde friend, who got it, decided to share it with her and her daughter was on five different prescription medications for breathing issues that she's no longer taking. And she was two at the time and now she's three. So here's what the point is of this image. It's to tell you that people are out there and they are waiting for you to say yes. You need to say yes first for these other people to come alongside and they will. 
And so this is what's important in my life, right? These are my kids. This is my husband. This is what makes me happy. And what is number one in my heart is now one number one in my time with my time. And that is where, that's what I really want to see us make a shift in because we're at a point now where I'm going to say parents, but it's everyone, you know, we all have passions and we want to do those things, but we have to check off this, this nine to five, which is really an eight to six or whatever it is for you, but we have to do that first. And what we really care about is second. And I'm here to tell you, you can find something where you can make what's number one in your heart, number one with your time and still earn an income. And it can be a substantial income and it can be lucrative and it can be real and it can benefit others. Oh my gosh. I don't think you could ask for anything better. So it became very clear to me, you know, and as I, as I looked in and I, and I researched this deeper and deeper that I wasn't here by accident. And, um, I decided to pay attention. I decided to think I was dragged to that event for a reason. You are watching this video for a reason. This is not an accident. You've gotten to the end of it. This is not an accident, right? So I want you to think about it. You don't meet people by accident. This wasn't shared with you by accident. Nothing in life happens by coincidence. Knowing this, start paying attention. Don't say, well, this is for the person who shared this video with me. Maybe it's for you. Maybe there are people out there waiting for your yes. So it isn't an accident. I'm so thankful that I decided I don't want to be different. I don't want to do something unique. I don't want to have to explain this to people. But I had to get all my questions answered. And by getting all my questions answers, answered, by digging deeper, I found that this was totally right. And it is a real opportunity. And I cannot keep it to myself. And you deserve to know about it. And the people in your life deserve to know about it. So I hope this has served you today. Have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day. And I hope I get to talk to you soon.